William Henry Harrison was our ninth president, but then he died. Coming into the presidency at 68, Harrison was the only president with a degree in medicine and the first president to die in office. Nicknamed Old Tippecanoe because he killed a lot of Native Americans in the Indian Wars, he was criticized for being one of the first Whigs after a long line of Democrats. They said he was old and feeble and unintelligent, and he was like, old and feeble, I'll show them, and then he died. Really, he was sort of asking for it. His inaugural speech was the longest of all presidents, 105 minutes in the freezing cold with no coat or hat. Through weeks later he caught pneumonia and then he died. After only 30 days, and it's kind of ironic because his big inauguration speech was like, hey, I'm gonna change everything and the wigs forever, man. And then he died. His death sparked a constitutional crisis because they're like, who, who are we gonna make president now? Harrison was inarguably the president that got the least done since he died. His grandson was also president, so that's kind of unique. And there's not really much to say about it. He had a pet billy goat. I don't really like this Harrison guy.